clip number two. In this clip, we can see the movement of swimming flagellar sperm in different fish species. First, we see a population of carp spermatozoa recorded by high-speed camera and visualized about 20 times slower than normal speed. This is a close-up view of spermatozoon from northern pike. Careful observation of the flagellum shows locally some blebs which are resulting from the osmotic shock at activation. This is a sturgeon spermatozoon at high magnification. Again, we can see that after a few minutes post-activation, a long flagellum are some blebs which result from osmotic shock. This is Pancasius spermatozoon. And this is a spermatozoon of tilapia. We see that in this species, the flagellum of this spermatozoon is very short. In case of salmon sperm, the flagellum presents rapidly some blebs that contribute to stop the movement. Here we see tuna spermatozoa swimming at real speed. They are marine species, so they swim in sea water. This is turbot spermatozoa which are stopped by application of CO2. And the same at low speed, where we see that application of CO2 briefly stop and then flagellar waves reappear. Thank you for your attention.